Hey guys, today I am going to do a most flattering bikini haul video. So as you can see by the title, that's what I'm doing. Oh my god, my hand. It's so light. If you have me on Instagram or Twitter, you actually already know this. Actually, it doesn't look too bad. I thought it looked worse, but I have about five ash five <laughs> ashes. I have about five eyelashes per eye. And this is due to the wind of Mykonos. So, anyway, I did, it must have been like two months ago now, a Zaffle bikini haul, which you may have seen, you should have seen. But today I'm gonna do a general bikini haul, and I've been away a couple of times since then, so I have sussed out my favorite bikinis, and just everything you need to know about each bikini. They're all from different shops. There's quite a few from Zaffle but there's a lot from other places too. And yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. So, the first bikini I'm gonna talk about, this purple bikini. Where's the bottoms? Oh, it's falling. This one. So, this is from Zaffle. I don't know the exact prices of all these bikinis because I bought them a while ago, but I think this one must have been around like 15 maybe, 15 to 19 euros. Yeah, they do it in euros on Zaffle. So yeah, I got I get all my Zaffle bikinis in a small. With the Zaffle bikinis, which I did explain in my other bikini haul, they are always very small fitting. But because I have small boobs, I can fit in the small. But if you have bigger boobs, you definitely will need the medium because they are very, very small. The thing that they all well, all the ones I have from there do, is they have the Brazilian bum. Keep sure it's like, why do you say bum? <laughs> <laughs> I know. Brazilian bottom. <laughs> so it goes, it's like a thong. <laughs> it's like a thong. But they are acceptable now because a lot of people now have the Brazilian bottoms because they are very, very flattering. And I think a lot of people find with other bikini bottoms that aren't Brazilian. Maybe not everyone, but I know, I think a lot of people do. They find that they, I, I find that they are, they go saggy on your bum, especially when they get wet after a while, they just go a bit saggy. So that's why the Brazilian are good. And this color of purple definitely enhances your tan and makes you look more brown. So it's really good and it's quite sort of sporty looking. It looks a bit like a sports bra. I wore it as a sports bra when I was in Paxos. I think this is probably my favorite bikini. Definitely a good one. So the next one I'm gonna show you is from Topshop. Had quite a lot of questions about this one when I wore it once. I haven't worn it in a while actually. But the thing I love about this one, it's falling. It's kind of Brazilian, I make it Brazilian. Um, it's not as small, so it's good for people that don't completely feel comfortable with the Brazilian look. It's not so thongy, but it can be thongy. Nice material, very good quality. The top I really like because you have the option of making it a bandeau or not, so you can the straps are removable, so it can be a bandeau or it can be a strap one. The bottoms are quite big because I often get an eight, I'm a six to eight in bottoms, and these are a six, and they are almost a little bit big. I usually would get an eight, and that would be a little bit tight, and these are a six, so they're a little bit bigger than normal, but not overly. And I got a six in the top as well. This has no padding. Some people may not like that, but it doesn't bother me, because I haven't got much to pad. I will try and put all the links to all of these below, but... I may not be able to find them all. I'll try and get as much as I can. So the next one is this yellow one. I actually bought it off someone on Depop, but I know that they sell it on Zaffle. So this one I think is another one of my absolute favorites. It's just cause I suppose the color is so, I don't know. It's just a very standouty color. It has the Brazilian bottoms again, but they're not too thongy. I like that the sides have this really thin bit because I think it's it just looks nice on. It does have the pads in the top but it is very small. This is a small again and it really looks nice with a tan 
and makes your tan pop. So this one I got a few days ago from In The Style. It's from Sarah Ashcroft's collection. The top kind of gives you a little bit of under boob but you can cover it if you don't like that. And I like it just because your tummy is still on show. These, this kind of cut I think has come in this year because I saw it on Love Island as well. The only thing I find with this is like if you love partying, this is like the best. It's kind of, it's quite a fancy one I'd say. I, I'm not, it's a little bit too fancy for me, but yeah, and I'm not much of a partier, I'm a bit of a granny, so if I did go out more, this would be great. If you go to Ibiza or just like pool parties or things like that, you could even probably wear it as a top and it would look nice. But because I don't do that, I don't really want to get the tan line, so I don't really want to just wear it to the beach. So yeah, it's just a little bit too fancy for me, but it looks so, so nice on. So, ooh, what is that? <laughs> I hope that wasn't there long. <laughs> Please ignore my hair, this is all from the 34 mile per hour winds. <laughs> a lot of people ask me about the sizing on this and I would say either go for your size or size down if you're nearer the, the end, the, if you're a small size of your size, go for the size down. But otherwise go for your normal size. The next one is a bikini from a brand called Toco, I think that's how you say it. Literally the top looks like nothing. You definitely can't really have big boobs for this. I think it's a new brand. I don't think they have that many different styles out yet, but they do have, I think they had yellow and navy, and they had, these have the Brazilian bum, but they also have the elastic on the bum, which is even more sort of flattering, I think, on the bum, because there is no scrunchy, it's not going to sort of scrunch up anywhere. So I got the fuchsia red colour. And I got this in a small in the top and the bottom and it fits me, but I have small boobs and so I'm not sure, because there is no sort of support in this, it's just material. I'm not sure if you had bigger boobs that it would really work. If, if you had big boobs, I think they would just kind of bulge out and your nipple would come out sometimes and things like that and unless you don't mind that, I wouldn't recommend it, but if you are smaller, it's really nice, it just kind of looks great and nobody really has it yet because it's a new brand. And the material's like really soft, I think it's kind of, you can tell it's, it's a little bit better quality than Zaffle. Zaffle quality is good, but sometimes they do feel a little bit sort of, I don't know how to explain, they just feel a little bit, like they're not that soft and they kind of feel a little bit rigid sometimes, but I still buy loads and loads of Zaffle bikinis. Zaffle's probably the place I would go to for bikinis, but with this quality, it's very soft and you can just kind of tell it's a little bit better quality. I can't remember how much it costs, but it wasn't too bad. And the yellow one was really nice. The reason I didn't pick yellow is because of the Zaffle one I had. And the navy one was really nice too. So yeah, I definitely recommend that. The next one is another one from Zaffle. It's a pink velvety one. So it has a padding in it, but I wouldn't say it supports you very much. Yeah, I just, I wouldn't say it's that supportive but it is flattering. The bottoms are very thongy. I think they're probably the most thongy bottoms that I have. And also there is like no elastic in it at all. So the small is very tight. It just about fits around my hips. But I think you would almost definitely need to size up than your normal size in this one because the triangles on the top are very small as well. But it is really nice. It's like a velvet, baby pink which I love and it's just a bit different the velvet to it I guess and it doesn't get ruined in the sea even though it is velvet so yeah that's another good one but definitely size up because it is very small and then I have two more things the next one I don't have the top to go with it but these bottoms are from Zaffle but there, there was a crochet white triangle bikini top to go with it but I actually just wear it with any sort of top that I have. So it goes with the yellow top, it goes with, I like it with the purple, the deep purple top. 
and it goes with this purple top. It goes with anything really and it just kind of spices up your bikini a bit because it's got a pattern. It's kind of like palm trees but I'm not sure if it is because it's a little bit more like leaves. Leaves. <laughs> But it's, it's quite an elastic -y bottom, which I like because a lot of the Zaffa ones aren't very elastic -y. And it's the thong bit again, but it's not over the top tiny. So if you don't like want too much thong, then this is a good one again. The top it comes with is nice, but I don't like to wear white bikinis that much because I find that they discolor quite quickly. So yeah, that's another good one. And the last one is this red bikini, these are the bottoms, from Zaffel again. So I got this in small again, it's quite small, again, go up a size because they are very small, especially this one doesn't have it, well it has a little bit more give in it than the light pink one, but it's still not that, actually it is quite elastic -y. that was a lie, it's not too bad but the, the triangles on the top are quite small. There is a little bit of padding in this one, which I like because it kind of makes, it kind of makes your boobs look quite perky. So I quite like my boobs in this one. It doesn't flatten them too much, it gives them room. But yeah, again, the red just looks really nice, especially when you're tanned. And yeah, it's just a nice bikini. I like the thin sides. Also the bum on this one is slightly bigger too. So if you don't like too much bum on show, this one does cover up slightly more than a lot of the Brazilian ones. And yeah, it's just really nice. I used to hate strap bikinis because I didn't want the tan lines, but now I just pull them down. And especially with this one, I find when you're sunbathing like that, it doesn't fall down because of the support in it. So that's another good thing. So yeah. That's all the bikinis I'm going to show today. I will try to leave all the links to them in the description box, although some of them I may not be able to find, I don't know, because some of them I've had for a couple of months now. And I hope that was helpful, I hope it was a little bit helpful, and maybe you found a bikini you want to wear on holiday. And if you have any more questions about anything, just leave them in the, di the not the description box, because you can't write in that. Leave them in the comments and I will reply to you as soon as I can. Thank you so much if you watched all of this video. I'm going to try and make it not too long because at the moment it's quite long. But I will try and make it shorter. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.